so let us first see the definition of unidirectional system then we will understand it through an example so what is unidirectional system in unidirectional system dimensions are placed in such a way that they can be read from the bottom edge of the drawing sheet all dimensions are placed at the middle and are inserted by breaking the dimension lines at the middle so let us understand this through an example so first of all we will talk about horizontal dimensions so in this case also first of all we will draw extension lines then in between those two extension lines we will place dimension line followed by close filled arrowheads now in unidirectional system the method for placing dimension is different in aligned system we were saying dimension should be placed above the line and at the middle of the dimension line but over here we place dimensions on the line by breaking it now you, you will see over here see we have placed dimension on the dimension line by breaking it from middle and one more thing to understand in aligned system we said that horizontal dimensions should be readable from bottom of the page and vertical dimensions should be readable from right side of the page but look over here the name is unidirectional that means direction is same uni means same it means if you are placing any dimension under this system whether that dimension is horizontal dimension or it is vertical dimension or it is inclined dimension still you have to place dimension in such a way that it should be readable from bottom of the page and first two rules you have to apply that it should be on the dimension line after breaking the dimension line from the middle now let us understand the vertical dimensioning under unidirectional system first of all we will draw extension lines dimension lines now you can see how we have placed the dimension dimension is readable from bottom of the page and it is placed on the dimension line after breaking the dimension line so let us see inclined case now now you can see it is on the dimension line and at the middle of the dimension line after breaking it and it is readable from bottom of the page earlier in aligned system we were placing dimension in such a way that the dimension was at 90 degrees to the dimension line always but over here dimension is readable from bottom of the page for all the cases so let us quickly see the other inclined dimensions now again you will see we have breaked the dimension line it is placed on the dimension line in the middle and it is readable from bottom of the page again see it is not at 90 degree to the dimension line fine so similarly over here you can see bottom of the page readable from bottom of the page it is readable from bottom of the page now uh, we will see how to place dimensions for different angles so in case of a line system we were placing above the line but over here what is the case that we have to place on the line after breaking it so first of all we will break it from the middle so by breaking i mean you will use your eraser you will first draw the dimension line then you will erase it from the middle then you will place it on the dimension line. so you can see after drawing the curved dimension line we will erase it from the middle with the help of eraser then on the dimension line we will place the dimension and dimension will be redual from bottom again so everywhere you can see dimensions are redual from bottom of page so, so direction is same that is why it is labeled as unidirectional system so i hope this uh, system is clear to you